This is my ba basil and today I'm going to cut it and freeze it and I'm going to show you how I'm going to do it. I will do it like in so I will have to do like several videos but I will show you. So the first step is I will cut it. So and I think I will cut um I will not cut it all. I will cut it like part of it and then I will probably leave stems and um, dry it but leaves I will freeze and I will show you what uh, how I will do it so here we go here's I cut it all here's my um, basil ready to work on and I left some so if the weather would be good like you see some growing so hope always growing can come back so I will have more basil so but yeah and so here it is. Now I'm going to cut all the like um, leaves and like growing which is like fresh and this I'm going to put in my food processor for um, freezing but the steam, stem which looks like this will freeze and then I can add it to my um, when I do my broth I will just add it during the winter month so this is what I'm going to do with all this and I will keep you updated. Okay, and I'm done with my step two. So here you see my leaves, the one which I'm going to put in the food processor with a little water. And here's my stems. Stems I'm going to dry. I'll just put it in a newspaper inside my house and wait till they dry. And then I might cut it in pieces already now. Maybe I will break it down later. And then I will put it in a like jar. So when it's um, when it's done, when it's dry. So this one I will I'm going to use for my broth, to add to my broth, and this one I can add to any dish. So okay, guys. As I said, it's my first time, so I will see how it will go. So it doesn't look like everything fit in once. So and I add a little water here. You see water? So I will keep you updated after I started. And here I bought this little from a dollar store. Bought it. Um, for my few for use so let's see how it will go I will get back with you in a second after it run for 25 seconds I notice I have more space so I add all the leaves the rest of the leaves so now it's everything so I'm starting it and now we'll just wait till it's all like done so all the leaves we had this is all what left not much so now i'm going to use a spoon and just put um into my container and then i will freeze it then i fill it up and i will just freeze it and then after it's all frozen i'm going to put it in a ziplock bags and here it's ready and just think how like it would be nice during the winter month to have this kind of herb and it would be fresh so hopefully this is my first time so I don't know but we will see and I will I will let you know when I try to eat it later and here what we finish with uh, it's just one tray and I'm going to put it in my freezer and here's this going to be dry so and we will see how it will go because it was my first time to do this and then I will try probably will try it very soon next time when I cook my pasta I will just add one cube after it freeze and see how it will if it add any taste but I'm sure it will and actually if it works it's a great way to preserve herbs from a garden so okay hope you enjoy it and here is my frozen cube so I'm going to take it out and put like in a ziplock bags and I will put like name of a herb and date and so this is how I will keep it in my free in my uh, freezer and here's my final product I thought I will need two bags so and I put like name of a herb, herb and date so this way I will know when did I do but I guess I just use one and this is how it looks it's like frozen uh, piece so and it smell it smell good so I'm going just to keep it in my refrigerator 
so and I'm happy. So we'll see how it will taste. And I hope you will try it too. Thanks for watching and as always please leave comments and subscribe.